Welcome back. Now I'm going to continue our discussion about the if statement and in this video I'm going to see how we can nest an if statement inside another if statement. So let's open IntelliJ ID and I'll go inside the else. I'll use the code from the previous video and I'll type here if. I'm going to put another pair of parentheses inside the parentheses that we have here. So I'm going to parentheses and I'll type if age minus is if uh, 18 minus age equals equals one then it's gonna say year so because it's only one year left until that person can uh, can uh, vote so it's gonna say year but if that is not the case let's put the curly braces let's press enter let's add this line of code there else it's gonna say years because that means that there are more there is more than one year until that person's person can vote. So I'm going to type, let's copy this, let's paste it here, and it's going to say years. Now, we have 18, let's change this to, to test, let's change this to 17, let's run our app, and let's see what we get. It says you can vote, please come back in one year, and let's put a space also here. Let's run it again. So it says you can't vote, please come back in one year. So this condition evaluates to true. Our uh, 18 minus age equals equals one and it's executing this code block. Else it will execute this code block and it will say years. So if I change this to let's say 16 and if I run this, Yet you can vote, please come back in two years. Now it's saying years, not years. So it's executing this line of this uh, code block. All right, I will end this video about if uh, how to nest if statements, and I'll see you in the next video.